Hi church, it's Liz Tamara, Director of Early Childhood Ministries here at Wesley United Methodist Church. It's Tuesday, November 23rd, two days before Thanksgiving, and I'm bringing you this week's midweek devotion. This year's been hard for so many of us. Um, we thought that we would get through COVID by now and our lives would be completely normal. We thought that we would have all the holiday memories this holiday season that would be normal, like we knew pre-COVID. For some of us, our holidays will still be a little bit abnormal. For some of us, our holidays will be forever changed by this pandemic and we're missing out permanently on memories with people that we love. People who have gone before us and are now having Thanksgiving with Jesus, we won't see them this year. But I was reminded by First Chronicles 29, 13, and now we thank you, our God, and praise your glorious name. And that verse struck me as a reminder that even though this Thanksgiving won't be as easy as I thought it would, there are still things I can be thankful for. I asked my coworkers at Wesley to share some of the things that they're thankful for this holiday season. They're thankful for family and friends. They're thankful for health returning and the re-entry into a more normal life. They're thankful for the folks who quietly care for others without looking for recognition. They just stand up and do it. And they're thankful for exactly who each member of our Surge family is and the place we have in the kingdom of God, that we are learning how to be unapologetically ourselves together and that we love each other well. When I had to answer what I was thankful for, I was reminded, Wesley friends, that I'm thankful for you. That you have been there for me and for my family in a year that has been so incredibly life-changing. Moments that have been difficult and moments that have been proud and happy and joyous. So as we get ready to put the turkey in the oven or maybe the turkey socially distanced behind masks once again, I ask you to remember friends that no matter what, we are going to make it and we have lots to be thankful for. I thank you so much for loving my family during this tough year, for helping us to know that no matter what, we are loved by you and we are loved by God. Rest easy, friends. Get the house clean. Get the plates polished. Find the fancy napkins. Thanksgiving is coming. We love you so much, church, and we'll see you soon. Have a great week.